superstar who loved auto racing decided to do a picture about his sport. He wanted to film it all at actual racing speeds, to use no trick photography. In short, to attempt the first completely realistic racing motion picture. Steve McQueen, who has been successfully racing motorbikes and cars for at least as many years as he's been starring in top box office movies, chooses to film at Le Mans in France, where each year the world's most famous motor races run. The production problems are staggering. In the 24-hour race at Le Mans, men and machines are put to a brutal test of speed and stamina. Realistically restaging the race for the movie presents difficulties never before faced by a motion picture company. The circuit is 13.469 kilometers or 8.418 miles, composed of country roads linked with the main highway, nearly all of it open to traffic 363 days a year. Along the 3.2 mile Mulsanne Strait, the cars reach a maximum speed in excess of 230 miles per hour. Just to capture the grand spectacle on film is an ambitious task. There are 55 cars and 110 drivers, representing countries from all over the world. And ever present is the element of danger, 